This week, several of our schools in the South Washington County District are participating in the Hour of Code. This year, we've really, really invested time and energy into it. We've had teachers getting trained through code.org um, and getting curriculum through them and really trying to embed that into what we already teach. Today, we're learning about how you do coding. It's such a different concept for them. It looks like a game, but you know, behind the scenes, it's coding. They're doing some higher level thinking. Coding is going to be a huge part of their future just in the 21st century. They're probably going to have some type of component that requires technology and um, using it, and at least using critical thinking skills and problem solving and logic. So it's a good thing all the way around. Because it's so huge and so big of names behind it, um, the kids are excited. Sometimes they see some of the stars that are coding some of their commercials. We're really trying to emphasize getting girls and everybody involved with this and girls in particular because there aren't as many girls out there in the workforce that are choosing to do computer science. My favorite part about coding is probably just coding. <laughs>it's rewarding when I see different students succeeding at you know something maybe maybe computers wasn't their thing and all of a sudden they this is kind of neat it's almost like a game they catch on that's pretty cool I think coding is cool because it like you can make it do whatever you want I feel like it's very important that we learn this earlier because a lot of stem and stuff like that kind of you need to learn a little more computer stuff a little more like that and a lot more jobs will accept you if you know more about that. When I grow up I could definitely see myself being like a video game coder. When I grow up I probably would maybe want to go like into a programming field. When I grow up I'm I think I might want to be a coder.